again, one of those who will hope that his season isn't over, that he has one more game to prepare for next week. Burns hoists it high, a test for Freeman. Stewart was there. It was a lovely battle between two young fullbacks who have again caught the eye today. Yeah, but Freeman's just been peerless, really, isn't he? He's been unbelievable in the air. Oh, Leicester have it. Montosha has it. He's leading Leicester's charge right now. And Saints, a man down a rather hanging on here. Visa. Once again, Northampton's defence that's worked so hard. Again, being tested. Oh, look at Genge driving on. The fire and the determination. George Martin amongst those waiting. Saints have done well to spoil it, but Leicester in the end restaff it just in time. Visa again. Courtney Law's working hard to slow that down. Van Portfleet, Ford. Driving on, Freddie Burns, Leicester that close. Van Portfleet goes again. These are desperate moments for Northampton. Desperate moments. Hanro Liebenberg waits. Whole lorry load of Leicester forwards ready to join in. Ford offside. clapping for it. Sets offside. Yeah. Leicester free ball. Ford. Listen to the noise, look at what it means to these fans, and it all came from the breakdown. Hayward taking it forward, and it just squirts out. And first man to react, Montoya straight down on it. And Ellis Gange, look at the leg carry now, just manages to shrug off the efforts of Tom James. Look at this, staying on his feet, winning those vital yards, and then lovely little. Show and go, and finally the vision again from that man, George Ford, knows exactly that Stewart's on the outside. You've got a feel for the Saints. Really big conversion. Really big conversion. Amidst the noise of Ellis, Genge being replaced, this is a kick to take Leicester a score clear, heading into the final ten minutes. Leicester still within punching range, 21-14. Well, he missed the kick, but how good was the pass? He's got his arms up in the air, he knows he wants the ball, he gets blitzed on the inside by Freeman, but watch Gozan, he just gets completely lost by the pace of the pass. Most people would. He's got no idea who to take. First man, second man, so he decides neither of them, and the ball goes straight across. It's a brilliant pass from four and a wonderful finish. Oh, Stewart. You cannot take your eyes off this game. A seven-point lead against the Saints this season. Nowhere near enough. Well, he'll be uh, he'll be working alongside learning alongside Anthony Watson next season. Watson on his way from Bath to add to Leicester's fullback options. Freddie Stewart's done all right this season. Ford. Out of the shadows, into the sunshine. That is a good kick. It's gone backwards. It was taken in the end by Grayson. Ford underneath it. Gathers it carefully. And again, where's this one going? Coming out of the sun. That is a devil of a catch for Freeman to make. And then Leicester are all over it. And they have it. And Martin has it. And it's a knock-on. Leicester will have the scrum. So again, free ball. Liebenberg, Visa, he's run his socks off today. Martin, out of the back, Ford, Burns, back to Ford, Potter waiting for it, he's got Moroni up in support as well. And Leicester will have uh, now a defensive scrum to deal with off the knock-on. Yeah. Advantage over from the original knock-on from Freeman as Painter comes back to the field. Yeah, well, Painter's coming on because there are still three minutes to go on Heffernan's okay, yellow card, and it's a scrum, so Northampton need a full front row. Okay, so yes, it ended up being a yellow card that's cost Northampton Saints on the scoreboard, isn't it? 
Skosen, the man who has to make way. How good has Freeman been? At the back, only fourth start this season. Look at this, takes the eyeball out the sun, then he stays on his feet, beats one man, beats the second. It's double hit, though. It's a double hit that dislodges him. That guy has got a really big future, I think. Very similar to Stewart in a lot of ways. Big, strong, beats people. Uh, you know, as quite deceptively nimble for someone so big. He's actually added, I think, 16 kilos over the last couple of years um, to give himself that power that we've seen used brilliantly today. Yeah, take nothing away from Freddie Stewart, who's magnificent, but I think the way that Northampton Saints play, it allows Freeman to show off his skills a bit more, you know. George Ford kicks the ball so much that we don't necessarily always see Freddie Stewart ball in hand. Two minutes left on the yellow card. Northampton without their left wing court off Skosen right now. So there's a bit more real estate for Tommy Freeman to have to cover, but it's not an issue at the moment, not least until Leicester get their hands on the ball, and they have it now with Potter. Saints getting really tight defensively, Nick. Leicester really deep in the backfield. They've only got kick on the mind and field position, but there is an opportunity to attack out there if they want it, or a cross-field kick. Play the ball. Chesson's waiting. Uh, Porter came in. There's the kick. Tom James chasing it, but it's gone directly out. Well, it's that mistake that they were waiting for. It's a concern sometimes when you line, kick the ball to line. Leicester, whether you, with the clock running down, you're going to get opportunities, but... The mistake there is afforded Hayward and Co. a line out. Oh, maybe not. They won't get too many more opportunities in this game, you feel. They've got to make something of this play. Mikey Hayward, Premiership winner eight years ago. Is he going to get the chance in 2022? <laughs> Lewis Ludlam took it on, stabbed through by James. Ho, ho! To his defensive opposite, and again, we look at the shallow in goal area, and that'll work out OK in the end. Harry Potter's kick, dab down, so um, Northampton will have to restart from behind their own try line. I mean, that's just a massive loss for Northampton. They start with the ball from a line out, really good ball off the top and just kicking it straight time back off, time off. to the Tigers. Just, just the the post. Did he pick this up in front of the try line or behind? No, I think, it was, I think it had crossed. Does he touch it before? Because if he does, it's a five metre scrum, no. Well done by Grayson, that. Time's on. Well, it's one to compete for. Stewart, oh, it was Skosen who got there, and in the end, Skosen's hard work making sure that it's Northampton's to go with. Ludlam stretching, gathering. He's done well to gather that Ludlow, isn't he? Uh, Alex Waller goes in. James, Skosen again chases, Burns tracks it. Skosen got there again first, but it was into the arms of Hayes. Van Portfleet into the final five minutes. Visa tackled by Hinkley. What an end to the season he's had, securing his long-term future at the club. Had some dark, dark days when he was injured back with Exeter. Not clear. Van Portfleet. Freeman. Oh, that one not so secure, but. Um, Oh, it was. It was knocked on, and Leicester will have the scrum, and that's a big moment. Do you know what? It's a shame, really, from a player who's been outstanding. You know, you talk about winning the collisions and the aerial battles, tiny, tiny margins. It's tough. That goes backwards, doesn't it? goes backwards, he goes forwards. I tell you what, there's been some strange, strange calls in this game. I've got to say, I, I think it Saints are hard done by that. Okay, time's off. 22 replacement. Well, the replacement is being replaced. Freddie Burns has played the, the bulk of this match as a, an early substitute for Dan Kelly. And now Burns makes way for Namani Nandolo. And once again, the earth shakes a little.
Freddie Burns has, uh, has done the job earlier than expected. Nandole, who has enjoyed running at Saints' defence this season, four tries in the regular season against them, and he's got um, four and a bit minutes to wreak his peculiar brand of havoc. Yeah, and you know, you'd, you'd have thought that that might have come a little bit earlier, that change, but I guess timing is everything. It's now Leicester Tiger scrub, and they'll go for a penalty, but if they don't, they'll use the donut. Just looking at what he gives you, actually, because he's come over to the short side. Saints have had to put three defenders over here. That probably means that Leicester will try and utilise this way. If not, they'll just give it to him and he'll crash over. Leicester looking to uh, drive and maybe force a penalty. Not there. Nandolo, off he goes, holds on to it. It was Laws, inevitably, who was there to stop him. Martin. Really hard work over the ball from Heffernan, but um, to no avail. This is uh, Leitonunga, who came on to replace Genge. Ford, drop goal, it's low! And it is potentially beautiful! It will need to be checked, but I think that went over. I think that's the lowest of low blows, and it's the low the room to Twickenham for Leicester and Ford. Well, he can't believe over. it because it's such a scruffy kick, but it does make it over, I think. So yeah, I think. The only question is the crossbar. Yeah, really, look, really, really crossbar. sorry, mate. That's fine. Yeah. Well, it will be Stuart Terridge, the TMO, who has it within his remit. Did this go above or below? It skids over. Oh, it's a painful game. It's a cruel game, particularly right now for Northampton's players and their supporters. Can you say about George Ford? Doesn't really matter how you score them, it's a question of scoring them. An absolutely brilliant option. Ten points in it, three minutes to go. Is that it? Any other team, maybe beyond Harlequins, you would say yes, but it's Northampton. Times this season, they have dug deep into a box full of magic. They need that box right now. Van Portfleet. Oh, and Grayson, again, not taken cleanly, but this time it did go backwards. Grayson's done well. Skosen loses it. Oh, it's picked up! Potter! Oh, and Skosen got back brilliantly. My goodness, in defence just then, Skosen was sharp, but Leicester are pressing now. Martin, one more punch, and Saints will be on the canvas. Van Portfleet. Visa, Visa. Nearly there, Nandolo! Oh! Knocked on. I think he's knocked it on. It's Courtney Laws. How about the work right from Courtney Laws? I mean, you've got to understand that Northampton are now chasing the game. They've got to take a risk or two. Grayson, Skosen okay, did exactly Time that. Time off. Leicester turned it over. Let's have a look at this. Grayson initially drops it. Thank that you. definitely goes backwards. And Trying oh, to, to bring Skosen back. How about that? Chase him back. <laughs> hey, look at Courtney Laws here. Yeah. Yeah. He's carried strongly, isn't he? All game. Inches away. Yeah, but he's got to hit flat. If he's hitting down, last yeah. run. As the Dolo comes in with the carry, I think it's Courtney Laws that forces a knock on. Combination of him and Freeman. Desperate stuff from Saints. Well, inevitably, you think back to the opportunities that Saints blew in the first half. Certainly two tries, maybe even three for poor old Courtney Skosen. If they'd have scored those, even Leicester wouldn't have been able to hold them back in. Surely, 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 but they didn't take them, and I'm sure we'll be talking about that. I think they've been heroic. They've, they've filled in the gaps from the last two defeats here. I think up front they've been brilliant, but as you say, You've got to take those opportunities, and I think some of the 50-50 decisions by that man in the middle there have gone Leicester Tigers' way, no doubt about that. Two minutes to go. Leicester pushing hard at the scrum, a drawing a penalty. Game's as good as over. Well, no doubt about that decision, Leicester Tigers. 
Just think, just don't like the unsporting behaviour. Right, it was Jack Van Portfleet and, and, and Lewis Ludlam, who wasn't overly keen to give him the ball quickly, and that's what caused the scuffle, but Matthew Carley across very quickly to, to sort things out. Well, it's been a hallmark of Leicester Tigers all season. The scrum battlers swung backwards and forwards, but when it mattered most, they seem to have what it takes to come up with the goods. Look at this, this is Northampton's ball, by the way. They've been so strong up to now, they just get absolutely destroyed, pushed off their own ball. That you feel Turn is that. Turn around. Yeah. You, 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 you will be really, really frustrated yeah. if you get a second yellow and can't play. No, no George Ford. Point. No thrills and spills or frilly ribbons needed here. Just slot this between the posts. Get the job done. George Ford kicks his kick and Chris Boyd who has just been majestic during his time in charge at Northampton knows that the next big trip he'll be making is the one back home to the other side of the world well they've not been at their best of they Tigers but they found a way today they found a way to the final day and to Twickenham and you don't have to listen very carefully to hear Tigers roaring again.